Hi everyone. Our method, called Course to Find Deep Learning, was motivated by how the human learning happens. There is acquired knowledge from generic to specific concepts. For example, imagine a baby begins to understand what a ball is. At first, everything that's around for him or her could be considered as a ball. So, maybe the baby starts in front from learning which object is rounded or not and after that rich rounded object is re a real a ball. Following this rationale we propose three deep networks with the goal of identify a person. This top first network learning what a person is, a generic concept, and uh, the second one what the gender of a person, a more specific concept. The third network is a cup of two identical ones um, called Siamese network. The aim of this later network is to optimize a constructed connection function that measures the similarity between two images. In other words, this is the actual network responsible to identify a person. Uh, before training, the weights of a network uh, are initialized by the weights of the, uh, the previous one. That is, uh, knowledge learned previously is transferred to the other network. So uh, the learning is transferred from generic to a specific network. We call this approach uh, CFL, close to finding learning. Um, the topology of our networks, represented by this net box, is depicted in this figure. The topology is a proposed hybrid network, uh, comprised of three convolutional neural networks, subnets, one to each human body part, and uh, a full body subnet comprised of a proposed DBN DAE. Deep Belief Network, the Noise and Out Encoder. Um, these three subnets learning uh, the local features and uh, the other one, the global features. Uh, the proposed uh, person features is uh, represented by these two top layers together. Uh, the DBM, DBN DAE is trained in two stages. Uh, the first stage is a RBM, uh, a cascade layer-wise RBM training, and uh, the other one is a DBN uh, finite tuning with the proposed uh, uh, noise image as flat, uh, as flat image as label. The goal of this DBN DAE is to start in the global feature uh, to be robust to some noise. This figure shows the Siamese network in the evaluation step. Um, due to the time, I'm gonna skip to the results, okay? Um, our method shows in this figure, uh, in the cumulative curves, in black black curves, uh, is competitive over VIPE and uh, is the best, best over ILEADS dataset when it is compared with 16 uh, other state of art methods. And these two tables shows again uh, that our method uh, is is the best in the eyelids in the second over Viper dataset. Uh, in addition, um, we achieve the best top hang performance over CU eight key one and CU eight key three datasets. All right, thank you, Alex. Thank you.